The best part about our mission, as Lisa said, is to keep families together in an effort to minimize that impact to children. It's amazing when you can hear from families who've served in our program who can say that my child never knew that we were experiencing homelessness because we were able to either get them into rapid rehousing or get them into our short-term shelter program where we had children and families activities. They just thought they were staying at a new place with a lot of other families in their area. Um, so that's something that is really special to me about Families Together. And I've talked a lot about direct service, but what I also wanted to talk about was the expansion of our work into affordable housing and advocacy. As Lisa mentioned in the last few years, we really wanted to expand our mission into the actual problem of family homelessness and be able to make a dent in the um, affordable housing area in Raleigh, as well as try to impact and influence some of the legislation that's going through and the way that we can advocate for um, those families experiencing homelessness in our area. So we've realized how important affordable housing is in our community and how quickly it continues to diminish as Raleigh continues to grow. That's something that is always on my mind when we hear about all the wonderful things that are coming to Raleigh, all the big businesses, all the great opportunities. It does increase housing costs. It makes apartments um, very unaffordable for a lot of our families. So that is something that uh, we have to keep in mind as Raleigh continues to grow. And Families Together has made a commitment to increasing the supply of affordable housing for families experiencing homelessness. I'm excited to give you a behind the scenes glimpse of our recent duplex renovation project and the future plans for the undeveloped land where the cottage or where we're hoping that our cottage court can be located. So Jen, are you able to pull up the video of the 1109 Plainview Drive duplex renovation? Great. Are you all seeing my screen now? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. Getting ready to show it. Here we go. In 2020, under our newly launched affordable housing initiative, families together bought a house from a local church and began extensive renovations. The property would be used to create new rental housing that would be affordable for two families transitioning from homelessness. The house was divided into two, three separate bedrooms to accommodate larger families in our program. We are so grateful for all of our donors, volunteers, and partners who helped make this project a success. Thank you, Jen. I love that video because it's able to show you exactly where our donations are going to and also volunteer work and action. What a difference that made to that duplex and the fact that it's going to be fresh and new for two new families and their children to enjoy. 